Welcome, listeners, to Just Neapolitan, where we ask the age-old question, how did that worm get in your ear? Today we are all here, Maggie, Jordan Floyd, and your resident man in the box, Brian. What box? Or you outside the box. It's mm. an Alice in Chains song. Uh, okay, so you don't oh, know Steely Dan, yeah, you no, don't know, no, sure. uh, don't oh, know George Miller Band, oh, you don't Steely Dan. Absolutely. Hey, Brian, your age is will showing. Will you come back to me? I've never hidden it, so. <laughs> Listen, when you start losing the top in your mid-twenties and gaining some grays in your beard in your mid-thirties, the, the, what is there to hide anymore? <laughs> hey, at least your top waited until mid-twenties. <laughs> Wait, ain't nothing wrong with no, some, ain't nothing wrong with some steely Danny in your life? Well, also, oh, I, I don't know that because I had long hair. So it was all just kind of ah, like layered yeah. up there. Also true. It's yeah. when I went and finally got it cut short after having it long for years. But I was like, where did some of my hair go? <laughs> <laughs> so that was all a thing. What's everyone been playing this week? <laughs> let's stop talking about how old uh, I am. <laughs> oh. Let's stop talking about life. Definitely not a baby. Games. <laughs> He's a definitely not a baby. <laughs> Listen, I was born an old man, and I'm just growing into my personality. Well, I definitely yeah. probably get Fate Gamer of the Week, because I've not played anything except Persona today, so. Yeah, so then you that played, what yeah. like, literally the yeah. whole <laughs> week, probably at least a week and a half, I haven't touched anything. Listen, Jordan and I had one of these where literally the two of us had only played games that day, and we counted okay. it. Yep. All right. Yeah. It counts. It'd be, it'd be like that, <laughs> as long as you played a game. Like, life happens. Like, it, you know, we do, we do it for stress relief, right? But mm-hmm. there's definitely other things going on in life that need to be yes, taken care of. very much so. Not only playing Persona, uh, getting very close to, we can actually talk about it soon. I know. Ooh, I only nice. have, well, I probably have, like... At least, f- I only have three yeah, months left. I probably got like fifteen to twenty more hours <laughs> left. Uh, the, the last couple months go well, kind of quick. Well, cause... yeah, <laughs> because they're not letting me do anything. <laughs> I mean, that. Oh, no, just wait till you get to the, some of the later ones. You'll lose like weeks at a time That's for no reason. What I'm at right now, <laughs> I'm like, yeah, but it's the whole game for the other ones. <laughs> it's very aggravating i'm like i get everyone sad but can we pick up the pace please i'm over it now no no we will not (laughs) chop chop end of the world coming (laughs) i get that your loved ones died but come on (laughs) we only have three months until opening (laughs) week yeah literally (laughs) we gotta get this show on the road (laughs) yeah no more of this i'll do it on the day shit (laughs) but yeah that's been my week that's right What? Mm. What else anybody been playing? I talk. Um, I've actually played several games this week. It's it's kind of lit for me. Hey, oh, mostly Apex though. But I've 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 been playing Guilty Gear Strive and that JoJo's All Star Battle game, which that game. It's funky, know but I like is. it. Yeah, yeah. I gotta get, I, I gotta get used, I gotta get used to the, uh, the mechanics of that one. But I like it. Yeah, I don't. I don't but know I did. Yeah. I don't know what it is. I get that. Uh, it's a fighting game. I it's did. Fighting game. Yeah. I did try out Infinite Guitars to the game that uh, Candle mm, mm-hmm, put in mm-hmm, the yeah. Discord. I like that. I like that so far. It's cool. The whole the 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 Guitar Hero part of it gets me. I was like, "Damn, I didn't know I was this trash at this." But it, it, I like it. It's a fun game. I like it. Yeah, I was looking at that. One. I need to buy Paradise no, Killer yeah, that he was talking it. about. I need to buy that because that sounds right up my alley. Mm-hmm. Paradise Killer. It looks What's like that? basically it's a detective game, but it's like, mm. um someone died and you, you oh basically you can there's like a bunch of different people you can uh, assume that's like the killer and the game allows you to pick mm-hmm. anyone 
whether you're right or wrong, but you have to like justify your action. Mm. So you have to like tell everyone <laughs> why you decided on that. It looks really cool. Mm. Is that a multiplayer or is that um, a single? I think it's single, but let me pull it up and I can see. Yeah, just single player. A world outside reality. There's a bunch. Mm. Oh, there's been a murder that only investigation freak Lady Love Dies can solve. You can accuse anyone, but you'll have to prove your case in trial to conflict. It's up to you to decide who's guilty. Damn. Nice. That sounds right up my alley. <laughs> Yeah, it's like it's almost like someone was like, "What game could we make specifically for Maggie?" <laughs> and they did it. <laughs> they did. <laughs> yeah. All right, Jojo, you've been a little quiet here. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm still trying to get life together. Um, the game <laughs> I, we I'm all? A, look, the only game I've been playing this week has been Splatoon Three because I picked it up. Only on the weekend because I was at a friend's house, and damn it, I shouldn't have picked up the damn game. <laughs> I've just deep. been over here like, yeah, that I felt like that was the reason why I was casually stalling the game because you knew it was gonna was happen. because I know, yeah, I knew the moment I would have played it, I'd be going deep, and when I go deep, I'll be right back into Nintendo <laughs> Switch games. <laughs> <laughs> and I was trying to keep away from that because I'm like, oh shit! If I get if I play Splatoon three, I'm gonna be playing this multiplayer for a minute. Plus, the Splatfest is going on right now, and then I'm like, oh, but I want, I want, I got other games to play. I don't want to keep playing Splatoon three. But then I wake up every morning and be like, oh, I got a couple minutes to an hour. I'm playing Splatoon three. Splatoon <laughs> time. A splatters. I've never like really addict. gotten into Splatoon. Never really spoken to me. I've tried it a couple of times, but. Or do you like kid shooters? I mean, like I've played some like that before, but I've never really gotten into them. I get, I get why people like it, but every time I've played it, I'm like, mm. I'm good now. <laughs> I'm okay. Never picking up this game again. <laughs> Plays 20 minutes. I um, think I'm satisfied. <laughs> and that was fun. <laughs> Time to never play it ever again. <laughs> and then there's me. I'm in the background like, God damn it, y'all should have ink boy. I'm over here killing. <laughs> what the fuck? But yeah, that's my game. Yeah. So let's see. Oh, I, uh, I've been playing Stardew on the Switch. <sighs> I, I restarted one of my farms. Um, because I was getting to the end of summer, the first year, and I realized since I'm on the beach farm and I can't use, um, sprinklers on the beach farm, I had a revelation. I was like, oh, I can't make a shit ton of money on this farm because I need sprinklers to do that because otherwise it literally takes half my day to water all mm -hmm. these plants and I can't do anything else. So I was like, well, fuck the beach farm. <laughs> so I restarted. Now I'm first year in spring. Um, the uh, the rally DLC for Forza Horizon Five came out a couple days ago, and oh, yeah. I just finished that today. How was that? Nice. nice. So I know you kind of have a love hate relationship with with Forza. Uh, yeah, I have I have a love hate relationship with this DLC as well. <laughs> so what's wrong with? Well, it? I'm you know what? I'm trying to do this thing. Like I do with Dying Light, I want to do the positives first. So, mm. uh, one of the big positives, and this is something that they've done before, there's now two extra radio stations from what the game started with. Um, they did uh, for an an for, 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 uh, anniversary. Um, they did like a series where um, they paid homage to all the like the past four games, mm. and they added a mm. uh, like a mixtape channel. That has music from all the f the past four games on it. That's cool. So that was cool. Um, with the rally, they added a, a channel that's all just Epitaph Records, mm. which totally speaks to the punk in me. <laughs> and um, like, there's a bunch of bands on there I don't listen to because obviously Epitaph's still signing people, and I really haven't been big on Epitaph since high school. But there's right. at least a song by The Offspring and a song by Pennywise on there, so I'm a happy boy. 
Um, oh my god. What? Uh, mm-hmm. well, someone was just trying to call me, and I had, didn't turn my phone off. Oh. <laughs> um, no. You're good. Yeah. Yeah, and even better, it's someone from work, so I'm not looking forward to whatever that call That's is. for later. <laughs> That's definitely for later. That's also, I've, I've been drinking because it's my day off, so I don't know why anyone thinks I can go in. Getting way off topic. Okay, <laughs> so back to the DLC. So th- <laughs> it's, it's rally stuff, right? And they actually they did a, a really good job with um, the rally where you can turn your driving line off because you have your co-pilot who's calling out the turns. Mm. Mm-hmm. Now, it's, it's Forza, and you can't barely trust the driving line to begin with, so I kept it on. <laughs> um, also, the person calling is in a helicopter. Mm. Which I'm okay with because it, it kicks up dust on the course. And, you know, part of rally driving, you, you're not driving next to somebody. But a lot of times there's dust, you know, that you have to deal with. So, like, that was kind of cool. And yeah, right. so I, I enjoyed those races. Um, and then there's there's three different factions that you go. It's that's parts dumb. Uh, it's just to break it down into what races you can do when. And there's one of them where you do all your rally racing at night. So the problem there is, remember, someone's in a helicopter. So now that means that you have a bright light from the helicopter, like blinding you out of the track for half the race. As it scoots around up there, so I'm like, that was a bad design decision. Um, so also with the series, they added new stuff that you can do at night that has nice glows to it and really like makes the ray tracing look really pretty. So that was kind of mm. cool too. That's not in the DLC. That's anyone can get that. Um, mm. And then the bad. Um, well, all the bullshit race stuff that the game has had since the beginning is still in it. <laughs> so while I'm praising all the adding that's happening, fix the goddamn catch-up mechanic. And, and make the game race right yeah. again. Like, how do you do this right for four fucking games and then fuck it up on the fifth one and still not fix it, even though it's everyone's number one fucking complaint? Also, the DLC took me two days to finish, so... I See, I can't get behind that with DLCs. If yeah. I'm paying this whatever sort of amount of money, I want it to at least last me, I don't know a couple weeks a month or something you know like i know it's just a small portion of the game but two days and then i'm done and then i'm never going to touch it again no thank you well my thing too is so for each race now you can do it as a rally or you can do it as an actual race but so as far as they're concerned that means there's double the number of races i'm like no it's not (laughs) It's just two ways to bring the same fucking thing. And so right. I'm not doing that. There's drift zones. Fuck drift zones. I'm not fucking with the drift zones. Um, I don't care about your speed traps and shit you added in. They're like, I don't need more of those. I have those. Mm-hmm. Um, the little area, it's a new area. It's pretty. It's fun to drive around in. But I mean, you could say that about any Forza Horizon game. That's like the base level for a Horizon game at this point. Is it pretty and fun to drive in? Okay, good. Except that's it. And now how's the racing? Oh, <laughs> maybe shit? <laughs> I'm like... So yeah, that's that. And then before we got on here, I was on Elden Ring. We love Elden Ring. Nice. And by we, I mean I love watching you guys play Elden Ring. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> you love watching one of us play Elden Ring. Watch, I've watched Floyd play and I've watched you play. I've never watched Joe. Um, my was more a dig that they don't play ah, it anymore. Yes. Yeah, that was that was a dig. Mm-hmm. Hey, it's fine. It's cool. I'll be back for the DLC. As Floyd I'm loves to say. say, he's like, did I get what I needed out of it? Great. And then he'll never touch it again. <laughs> That's right. Also, Maggie, you missed the on, on funny moments between me and Elder Ring because I'm hard-headed. Like a motherfucker. Uh, we all know. <laughs> Damn. At least it's oh, I'm sorry. Did you think that was a life secret said, you were giving up? <gasps> oh my yeah. god, Jordan, hard headed. I would have never known. They tell me change weapon. I say no, no, <laughs> no. Hammers. We have Changes. never once told you to change your weapon. <laughs> no, I'm not, not saying. Stop trying to put this on us. <laughs> 
We've been like, hey, do you know if you double hand that, you get hyper armor when you attack instead of having a a hammer in each hand? I don't care. I'm doing two hammers. Okay, bro. I was just trying to help you out. (laughs) Yep. Multiple deaths, a lot of deaths. But he said eventually. Eventually. Yeah, just uh, make sure you're streaming when you go to fight Millennia. Yeah, please. I want to see that. Uh, I don't want to see that. (laughs) And then I'll stream next to you with my pirate build that is going to end up being so insanely underpowered for how the game's mechanics work, and we'll see who can do it first. I better win. I want to now want to do it. Do it. Onk? Yeah. (laughs) <laughs> you call him you call me a punk <laughs> you call him you call him me a puss puss I didn't say that listen I didn't say that okay you bati boy get to oh, it oh man Maggie's like I'm never gonna play this game and I know you yeah. a punk I'm feeding into his hard headedness because I want him to do it that's you know what? <laughs> the gauntlet has been thrown down sir you gotta do it you know what Nah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> you know what? Bet. Yeah. Bet. 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 Fifty bucks. <laughs> Bet. 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 Wait, you're actually Bet. betting fifty dollars? Sure, why not? Y'all wild. <laughs> I never even said which one I was betting on. <laughs> exactly. I'm right? too broke to bet <laughs> I just anything. Don't, I, I, just won't, I just won't give any information, and then <laughs> no matter what he does, he goes, I'll be like, you owe me 50 bucks. <laughs> I'm not betting on the 50, but, but I'm betting on Maggie. On me what? The nothing? <laughs> N- no. <laughs> to play the game again. I see your nothing, and I raise you nothing. Oh. Yes. Whoa! So we, So I win nothing, you don't win nothing. No gains. <laughs> Oh, y'all be crazy. You guys are <laughs> funny. Funny, ha ha. Not funny, oh, yeah, weird. but oh. not funny. Wow, but okay. But not funny, Damn. ha ha. <laughs> funny weird. Oh, funny weird. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we all funny weird. <laughs> Listen, weird is just another term for interesting. What I'm going to keep telling that's myself. Right. Yeah, that's what I've been saying my whole life. <laughs> I'll believe it one, one day. One of these days. One was boring. <laughs> Just one of them days. You guys know what we're talking about this week, though? What? No. Yeah, yes. I mean, you guys, you actually do. <laughs> yeah. You <laughs> wouldn't lie to the audience. I just, I, didn't, I just didn't have a good segue. That's that's all that was. Yeah, you were talking to the audience. <laughs> yeah. So just, we just answered for them. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's it. <laughs> Video game music. Woo. That shit in the background yeah. that when it's good, you notice it. When it's bad, you notice it. And when it's all right, you don't notice there it. There you go. <laughs> hey. I mean, it's truly, it's one of those things. Like, mediocre game music, I couldn't even list any for you. That's how mediocre it is. <laughs> and because we want to try to stay positive, we're not going to talk about bad video game music. It might come up. Because Maybe. it's us. <laughs> We're going to talk about our favorite video game music today. And we're going to do this in like little little bits. So we're going to start with what is like literally your favorite video game music track of all time? Oh. Do we, okay, or we could start with the more broad one. Do you want to finish on like the creme de la creme? I mean, even if we do, I don't know if I'm going to have a solid answer for that. <laughs> oh, I got a solid answer for those. <laughs> That's why I just picked one, and I was like, yep, except <laughs> You said, that sounds good yeah. enough. That'll work. <laughs> well, it is a song that I love. All so, right. fine. We're, we're starting with the track, then. So, mine is Bloody Tears, specifically the version from Super Castlevania Four, because they've mm. redone that song numerous times, and it actually was originally in Castlevania Two, uh, but then in Super Castlevania Four, they... There's like a read like updates of all the old music from the previous games. And yeah, mm-hmm. the Bloody Tears update in that is fan fucking fantastic. <laughs> that song rocks. That's like I can put that on and be all like, I'm gonna go slay some fucking vampires. 
<laughs> mm. And fucking Medusa nice. heads. And I feel like that's what oh. music should make you do, right? <laughs> Is feel that way. It... I don't always want music to make me want to go kill things. <laughs> but I'm saying a lot of the times <laughs> in video games, right? Like you want something that like hypes you up. Where sometimes you're like in the middle of a scene, and you're like, this music is not fitting the vibe. <laughs> like, this is not fitting what it's supposed to be happening. So when you're in a fighting game like that, you want to be hyped up. You want to be ready to go. Oh, yeah. I mean, that, that, that song is like the equivalent of let's fucking yeah. go. Most definitely. <laughs> yes, get it. I feel like my answer pew, pew. would just be... I feel like everyone's going to be like, oh, okay, here she goes. Because I... Well, we yeah, are now. Well, <laughs> yeah, we we Great. are going to Great. do that. Thank just you. Because so go ahead and just say no, But, like, <laughs> I am not someone who... When I listen to video game music, it's usually because I use it for studying. So a lot of the time I listen to, like, a Nintendo lo-fi playlist or something just in the background. Because I know that's music that I enjoy. But for, like, a track that I could listen to all the way through, I could listen to multiple versions of it, I could listen to whatever, like, it has to come from Kingdom Hearts. Like, it has to. Oh, This brother. guy stinks! Um, but... Oh, but this yeah. shit again. Whoa. Ooh, uh, tomatoes, tomatoes. Tomatoes. Yeah. It was... <laughs> but it's, it, it's one of those things where it's... And I know... At least two of you can probably agree with me, but it's very nostalgic to hear it. And I remember turning on the game, the first game for the first time and that like loading music, like right when it opens up, I literally got chills. I was like, this is already flooring me as like when I played it, it was way later than everybody else because it had been introduced to me much later in life. But I was like. 13 or 14 last year when i played it and it was just hearing that music even today and again it's a nostalgic factor now but when i open up the game and i can just like hear the music it gets me every single time and it gets me excited for the game all over again and that's what again what music should do too right is like put you into that space and into that mindset of like ready to go and you associate this song specifically with this game or this scene or whatever and i would say simple and clean because simple and clean is a great song but not even that song it's just like the piano like the it's piano the that they play is just stunning mm. stunning amazing work to me so i would probably go with Actually that Funny enough, I think the best version of Simple and Clean is uh the symphony yeah. version. Cause the how the way how the horns go, the the violins, the strings, it just sounds so beautiful. Mm -hmm. And if you like sit there and listen to it piece by piece and listen to every last instrument, if because if you have like that Kingdom Hearts nostalgic mm -hmm. factor, you might cry. Oh, I cry I cry probably you might the feel majority some type of, of the time <laughs> at this point. <laughs> So, honestly, yeah, my my for a track, my answer is going to be simple and clean. But I'm just going off Copier. like not even the nostalgia. <laughs> oh, oh, brother, <laughs> unoriginal. <laughs> Pick <laughs> your own. Fuck, fake gamer fuck you guys. shit right there. Fuck you guys. Carbon okay, copy I was gamer. Playing, I've been playing Kingdom Hearts since Kingdom One came since out. Kingdom, like, Kingdom One. one. <laughs> Yes, <laughs> Kingdom Multiple One, kingdoms. bitch. It didn't even have bases. hearts That's then. Really <laughs> <laughs> right, but like, but I was also a fan of like Utada before like they yeah. made that song, and then when I heard Simple and Clean on one of my favorite game series, it was like, boom, my two favorite things all in one. I can't, I can't yeah. not pick that. That's true. That's understandable. That's fair. You defend yourself well. <laughs> See, and un unlike the two simpletons over here, I'm going to stay away from Kingdom Hearts because I knew simpletons. all three of us probably would have just stayed in Kingdom wow, Hearts. Simpletons. <laughs> you pulled out a oh, simpletons, okay. man. Okay. He heard all simple right, and clean and right. he said, I'm, I'm just going to use that. this word to really roll into it. 
Oh no. The funny thing is the when the topic came up, I was like, oh god, three of us is about to talk about Kingdom Hearts. It's a good soundtrack. It's literally <laughs> such a good soundtrack. So it's like I gotta stay away from simple and clean. I gotta stick stick away from don't think twice. And luckily mm. I get to talk about this game again. Three I think this is about the third time I get to keep talking about Jet Set Radio. Only but this time Jet it's Set a, Radio. Yeah. But this time it's because of Hide, uh Hidekai Nagam Nagamura. I love how he does his music. So mine might just have to be concept of love. Cause you load up Jet Set Radio, you hear like flutters of like it's going through wavelengths in the moment that the game slows you automatically just get hit with concept of love and it it gets you there because it feels like a very futuristic vibe but it's still upbeat and you know that's something that i like i feel that i, I, feel I could that. also pick the scott pilgrim song oh. from scott pilgrim versus the world but Oh, I've got, I mean, trust me, I have tons of songs, uh, <laughs> but you know, you got to pick one, yeah. right? Yeah. Right. And and that's just the one I kept coming back to. Hmm. Now, I, I, go ahead. I do have a, I, I have one honorable mention though, Same. and I think okay. Jordan will probably relate to this. It's literally the opening song for Marvel vs. Capcom. <laughs> Like that menu Ooh. music. Oh, that's, that's no, that's good I love shit. it. Oh, that's so fucking <laughs> good. It's like every every time I hear that song, I get so hyped. I'm like, I know I'm finna fucking lose in this <laughs> game, but I'm be so excited about it. Like, <laughs> I'm gonna take you for a ride. See, I think one of my honorable mentions would have to be Super Mario World, the athletic theme, which is just mm. the. Uh, the usual overworld theme for most levels. But that's just such a good one, and I, I like in that how you get on Yoshi, and then, oh, here's some new drums on top of the song. Oh, yeah. Right. So I, I like that kind of thing that it does there, too, but couldn't give that my first overall. No <laughs> way. I, I think my yeah. honorable mention might have to be Live and Learn <laughs> from Sonic Adventures. Because <laughs> I don't know yeah. why, like... Look, I understand why, because Sonic Adventures, I grew up on it because I played it a lot on the Dreamcast. So anytime I heard Live and Learn, I was like, yeah, I'm enjoying this. And then I decide to not play the game no more, and I go straight to the music, and I'm sitting here like, Live and Learn! <laughs> I love that butt rock. I, I do. At least you didn't say Sonic 06, so you're all good. I would never say anything <laughs> on Sonic 06. Between Sonic, Sonic 06, Sonic in the in the uh, in the rings, and Sonic Unleashed, I would never talk about these games. They don't exist. Uh, All right, who wants to go next for favorite game? So the entire soundtrack of a single game. What's the best one? Can I go first? Yeah, go for it. All right, cool. Uh. Scott Pilgrim versus the world. I'm I'm taking it right now because it's something. That's mm-hmm. a great soundtrack. Son, I love that. It's something about Anamanaguchi. <laughs> it. I don't understand. I don't understand. Like everything that they did between going the world, um, the world soundtrack. It sounds so good. You load into the first stage is good all the way up to the boss fights. And it's something about like that pixelated sound. That does something to my ears is like, ooh, these are good beep bops. <laughs> these are good beep boops. Beep boop, beep boop, beep boop, beep boop, beep boop, But yeah, that that that's to me my favorite game soundtrack. Honorable mention is Persona Five though. I've I haven't oh, played it yet. Not there yet. <laughs> I think Persona Five has probably got the best music out of the series. Yeah, I listen to it by itself Persona, a lot. So do Persona I. Persona three so far. I, <laughs> I was talking to Brian about it a while ago, where I was like, "Oh, they just play the same like three or four songs over and over and over and over again." And after a while, you're like, "Okay, we get it." But it's one of those things where it comes on, and I'm just like, just singing along with it. Yeah, yeah, it gets you. Um, like even now, 
because in Persona 3 at a certain point when you start like your second year or something like that or whatever um, after the summer the music in the school and when you're walking around and stuff changes and now it's like all in French and whatever and even now I I I can understand some of the words they're saying, but I'm just like sitting in my chair and I'm like, do, 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 do. <laughs> like, like just singing along with it. So I'm excited to see what the other games, what their soundtracks are like, because I do thoroughly enjoy Persona 3. Yeah, 4 is a low point for me in that series musically. Mm. It's just a different style that I didn't quite enjoy as much. It's still good. It's just. The other two are fantastic. Yeah. Um, What's your game, Maggie? Oh, Lord, have mercy. Um, oh, <laughs> lordy, lordy. Um, oh, oh, oh. I, I feel like the only thing that's coming to my head right now, because uh, musically I can just hear it, would have to be um, Breath of the Wild, because... No matter what I'm doing in that game, the music, like, I could just be, like, sitting on a rock, like, not doing anything, and I just, like, have the music going on in the background, and it's lovely. Um, again, that is one of the, like, soundtracks that I listen to when I'm studying, because it just calms me down until, because I don't know why they keep putting this goddamn song in the playlist Taste for like studying, it. but it's the sound when something is chasing you. <laughs> 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 and you know it's like that build up where it's like Doo-doo-doo. hurry up no, finish the assignment hurry up it's hurry up where it's like, and i'm like, ah! <laughs> like freak out. wait you talking about when the guardian points at yes. you in the middle yeah, of yes. when the when the, yes. when the jazz piano that's what, starts that's up out of nowhere is. that's what it is yeah. you know you yep. fuck that's what it is it's when a and but and it's not very in, in real life and in the in the song obviously they don't have the beep 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 like when when it's locking on to you and about to shoot but mm-hmm. you can hear it. Yeah. <laughs> like, it's like Pavlov. It's like you can hear it in your head and you're just running for your life. Um, but that, uh, I would say soundtrack wise, other than that one song, that's something I always gravitate towards. Also, and this kind of goes into, I'm skipping a little bit, but this kind of goes into like series wise, but um Animal Crossing is definitely something that just like can calm me down really fast because I'm like, oh, it's just so happy and like there's nothing to worry about. And there's a lot of playlists that like do lo fi and add like rain sound in the background or like ocean sound in the background. And especially when I'm writing a 30 page paper, um, I need to be calm <laughs> and cool and collected. So that's definitely something as well that um, keeps me very grounded. I'm going to do my honorable mention now just so I can get all the the groans and stuff out of the way. Um, But (laughs) because this came to mind. (laughs) The Wii game. Bratz game. (laughs) What the hell is happening? What the the hell? hell? I instantly regret this topic. The music is so bad that it's good. <laughs> oh, no, I'm not trying to. No, it's, the shark, it's the Sharknado oh, of music. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Okay. You know what? You and again, it. and you, also, it is you, very you nostalgic. So, like hearing it, I'm like, oh, I'm like five again. You know what I mean? Like in my brain, I'm like, I still remember all this music, <laughs> but it's not good. <laughs> it's not good see, music, see. but I'll listen to it absolutely. See, I was about to say, like, I kind of envisioned Maggie in the midst of her talking, just like, I can picture Maggie just hearing that one song about the Guardian just coming through, <laughs> and automatically she either tries to parry, bum, 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 parry bum, in bum, real bum. life or try to dodge, and she's like, oh, wait, 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 I'm not in the game, not in the game, not in the game. My anxiety is already so yeah, high. If they could just take that out of the uh, playlist, that would be great. Thank you. It's not exactly a chill No, song. absolutely not. And especially when you put on a playlist and you don't expect it to be in there. Um, and I, literally in the middle of my paper, I was just writing and I was like, oh, this is so great. Because it was like um, one of the towns or something like that music was playing. And then it faded out. And then it was like, like the, <laughs> and I was like, whoa, 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 whoa. The, the mood instantaneously changed. Like, <laughs> like. 
all of a sudden my shoulders tense, my back tense. I was so stressed out. I had to go lay down. I was like, I can't write any more of this paper. <laughs> oi, oi, oi. Floyd, what's your game, buddy? Uh, Sonic Adventure 2, yeah. obviously. Oh, obviously. Obviously. That, that, obviously. Yeah, obviously. Uh, I mean, Have y'all not heard that soundtrack? Like, come on. No, mm. um, after Sonic mm. 3, I pretended he didn't exist anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, the Sonic Adventures dance is pretty good, and the soundtrack is pretty good. Yes, I, I will say, like they they tried to redeem themselves with the Sonic Adventure series, and I fucked with it. I really like. Then it. they dropped it, especially after. Sonic Adventure Two. Uh, yes, and then they completely dropped the ball after that series. Like, <laughs> sounds like Sonic Team. But um, yeah, but uh, no, the the soundtrack on like Sonic Adventure Two top tier in my opinion, top tier, especially. Highlight of that soundtrack, everybody knows, is Escape from the City. Like cool. that pinnacle, cool. top tier game music. And I, I'll, yeah. I'll just go listen to that every once in a while. I was like, yeah, I like this soundtrack. This is that shit. It makes me almost want to go back and play it. And then I'm <laughs> like, nah, I'm good. <laughs> so mine is probably going to be one that <clears throat> I'm not sure anybody knows, even this game. Um, but it's Metal Hellsinger which was a first-person shooter rhythm game that I was playing, but has, like, actual, like, singers from metal bands that worked on the soundtrack with them. Mm -hmm. And it's one of those things that as your combo goes up, more and more of the music comes in. Nice. Um, And just, like, every song was the fucking jam in that game. Like, if you like metal at all, it's so good. And... Oh, I just, I it, like, it pumped you up. It was so perfect for a shooter because metal, man. Like, what the fuck? Right. Um, so, yeah. So, had to give a shout out to that. Um, I have, like, a huge list of honorable mentions. Go for it. <clears throat> I almost went with Mega Man 2. Mm. Um, but then I realized I'm going to do a lot of SNES stuff. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> so, I was like, you know, <laughs> let's just, oh. uh, let's just, let's, let's, let's side with that. Um. Fuck, what was another one? Oh, I have like a list of these. Oh, uh, Vampire Survivors. I don't I don't know but that one. Nice. That one, which is oh, that's the one where it's like you're like you're you're almost like the tower defense, you are the bullet hell. And at, at the 30 yeah. minute mark, death comes and, and basically kills you. Oh. Uh, so those are your runs in the game. Uh but all the music from that is inspired by SNES, so once again I kind of always wanted to get <laughs> <laughs> oh, excuse me. That was much louder than I expected. <laughs> That's getting cut. Uh, <laughs> and then uh, Stardew Valley was another one for me. Oh, yeah. Um, well, see, Stardew, Stardew just... absolutely is in my top three, probably. But I feel like I knew that somebody yeah. else was going to go for it. So That was mine, too. I expected someone else to say it. So I was like, you know what? Let's do something else. I apparently could have stuck with that. <laughs> and then also Elden Ring. I expected someone to say Elden Ring. Elden Ring is one of those amazing games where it, the music fits so well that you don't notice it. But anytime you stop to listen to it, it's fantastic music. Um, I, mm-hmm. I think Breath of the Wild kind of does yeah. that too. Where it, since it's not playing all the time and like it comes in so softly mm-hmm. a lot that you don't notice it. But then whenever you notice it, you're like, oh, this is a really mm-hmm. good track. This is really good music. It's perfect for what's going on. Except, you know, when the, the jazz piano starts, you always you're notice like, that. Ah. And then it's like, and then you're like, oh, cool. Heart rate, 200 <laughs> oh, beats a minute. Awesome. Yeah, that's good for me. I feel like we all had that point where we, where we all thought Psalm was going to say the game, so we tried not to yeah. say it. Well, yeah. I still... You go. You go. Depends on the day what my number one is going to be. Let's yeah. be real. Um, You know, so... Well, Brian, you bringing up SNES, I was going to mention this and then I completely forgot. I love the music in um, Donkey Kong Country. Um, that's yeah. that's oh, one of yeah. my favorites. And yeah. there's a sound on TikTok going around that is like similar to the water levels in um, Donkey Kong. And it's supposed to be, people are putting it over like nostalgic video games or food or whatever, you know, from like the 80s 90s early 2000s whatever um and every time i hear it i immediately am transported back to playing donkey kong when i was a kid or even as a teen or even now and 
that music again it could be nostalgia factor but i think it's a solid solid soundtrack as well i'm lit <clears throat> i'm literally like jamming out in my head right now to the first level music <gasps> yeah oh yeah Man. yeah i love that it's, it's such a good way to start that game like instantly you're mm -hmm. in isn't that one doesn't the music also change when you get on an animal yes. in that one or am uh, i just yes right. yeah I think it does it, it, does. it, it adds does. an extra something and why don't more games do that these days excellent question mm -hmm. maybe I think they only do we're just not playing the right games that could i think only games. nintendo really does that especially like say for instance when you get on a yoshi oh yeah like Yucky. yoshi Yucky. automatically Yucky. just changes the sound of the music yeah it's too bad mm. about that game with that crying ass baby Mario. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> that game was great except for the Mario part. <laughs> like, could have just been a game about Yoshi, man. It would have been awesome. Right now, you just gotta save a fucking crying Mario, huh? Oh my god, and he's so fucking loud. <laughs> Sorry. They could have they could have turned down that damn baby and said, yeah, like, no, yeah, this is real, too real talk. Baby. What were real you fucking expecting? Talk. I was expecting someone to take it out the theater. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what they do with them once that happens. Not my business. Like, Jesus, that baby felt like it was like right up to the mic. Be like, all right, ready? Go. Wee. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I'm bringing PTSD, man. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I seriously, I played three levels in that game and I was like, fuck this shit. <laughs> it's like, I'm not doing this. The baby broke him. Yeah. It was just another, like, notch in the list of don't have a kid. <laughs> <laughs> have a cat. <laughs> much easier. Much calmer. <sighs> right. Except this one right now is like, pay attention to me because you locked me in here. And I'm like, I didn't fucking lock you in here. I gave you a chance to leave before we started recording, and you didn't want to. All right, series. Oh. I got mine. It's the Final Fantasy series. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, there okay. is... Even the Final Fantasies that I'm not a big fan of, I love their music. Yeah. You know... Final Fantasy does have some bomb music. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I could have literally you know used what? Final Fantasy for every answer because it would have been the opening theme to six, yeah. mm. Final Fantasy six, <laughs> and then mm -hmm. the series Final Fantasy. Yeah. If you can't guess what my favorite uh, game is in that series, some so you know what really has good like in the in the series what really has good music fourteen, mm. great soundtrack. Oh, mm. you're not gonna get us really to, to play it. <laughs> Come on! Be the same reason I don't smoke crack. I don't want to get we addicted. like we like life. We're not going to do that to I ourselves. Want somebody to play this whoa, game whoa, whoa, with whoa, me. Whoa, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa! Everybody, calm down for a second. Jojo talking about we like life. You literally just said what thirty minutes ago that you were playing Splatoon and that it took over everything. Ah 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 ah! Okay, you may got a point on me for that one, but I've been stating. <laughs> It for a fact, if I buy Final Fantasy fourteen online and play this, I will be a recluse. I will, will be, be a shut in. We'll become a Final Fantasy fourteen podcast. Yes. You can do that too. <laughs> you can have a separate podcast. Yeah. What, oh, oh what game God. you guys been playing? Well, this no, week on Final oh, Fantasy fourteen. 14. News. <laughs> I finally upgraded my weapon. It'd be exactly like it was when we first got into like uh what was that? No Man's Scott as a household. Oh my god. You oh, that was y'all. We didn't I mean, talk to people <laughs> for probably days. didn't even talk to each other, you probably just talked yeah. about the game. Well, no, because we also yeah. got into it when everyone was off work because shit was shut yeah. down. <laughs> there was nothing to do but yeah. sit there and play. You you go. Oh, I just played for eight hours. <laughs> this is play for eight, eight more hours. Yeah, that was a light day. Eight. <laughs> well, it was always the I'd get to the eight hour mark and be like, I need to shut this off, and I'd go eat something, and then like make a drink, and be like, well, What am I gonna do now? I guess I'll go back to No Man's Sky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I I still need to do that one thing I was working on. <laughs> just turns into forty fucking things. Uh huh. But uh, yeah, you guys should play fourteen. No, it'll be fun. No, no. Damn, no. one day we know it'll be fun. <laughs> That's why we say no. 
<sighs> no, not one day. Not a day. Don't make me do. I will give you motherfuckers subscriptions. I don't and care. And I won't download <laughs> that's it. Just, that's just mm-hmm. wasting. Yeah, no, the fuck I won't. Wasting money. No. no, the fuck I won't. <laughs> no, the fuck I won't. Download. You know it. what? You want to know when I'll start playing Final Fantasy fourteen? When? If there's ever a day when all the side shit that we try to do so we don't have to work anymore actually fucking works, <laughs> then Fine. I'll play it. But something tells me I'll have even less time if all that goes right. <laughs> um. Wait, oh, my body baby. Sorry. <laughs> for a series, would be. All right, get y'all boos ready because y'all gonna hate oh. this. Because <clears throat> it, it's gonna seem like a um a easy thing. I, 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 I don't have a drink. <clears throat> no, <laughs> I said boo. Oh, you, oh, you thought boo so, with a Z? Yeah. Mm. No, no, I'm not talking about alcohol. No. Mm. Um, it's the Grand Theft Auto series. Boo. What? It's a cop out Wait, answer. Okay, yeah. yeah. No. Stop being yeah. a cop out. An interesting point. I specifically didn't mention Forza because the soundtrack <laughs> is music that other people created yeah. as actual musicians. Yeah, that's interesting. Floyd, that's like me saying, know. yeah, my favorite series is the Guitar Hero <laughs> series. What in the hell? Yeah. <laughs> I didn't even think yeah, about that. Yeah, that, that, that one, I might have at least given you that one for being creative. Oh. See, that's but, why I went like, I when I used actual artists for mine, it was new mm-hmm. music that they made for yeah. the game. <laughs> and not fucking yeah, so, hits. I'm sticking with all it. Alright, yeah, it's fine. Fuck you have the tomatoes. <laughs> yeah. Let's move on to something more intelligent. <laughs> so, so yeah, not, it's not me. Yeah. Well, I, I, it's I not guess. Me. <laughs> I feel like we already hit the high water mark. Yeah, we did. Yeah, I think I think we should have finished with game. <laughs> uh, what is my favorite soundtrack of a series? Okay, well yeah, then, yeah. okay. Well, no, yeah. because, no, because, Whoa. no, because the problem is. I'm running out of tomatoes over here, guys. <laughs> uh, uh, God but damn. I can keep saying, uh, Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Not just the boo. Big boo. No. <laughs> Brian, no. To uh. <laughs> Brian, no, no, don't do it. I think it might have to be the Sonic series, but it has to be between one and three. <laughs> so, we so not the series. entire so, series exactly. So, then, <laughs> so you're wrong. So the series, as I, was on Sega Genesis, yes, yeah, like and then we'll just okay, forget that everything Sonic else series. exists, which is how yes. I do with the Sonic game. So that actually works for me <laughs> because I did if, forget about Sonic and Knuckles. That one was also good. Sonic and <laughs> Knuckles was pretty good. Oh, you know what? That and uh, the Sonic Adventure series. Those those two are like. <laughs> They're, they're neck and neck only because I thought of one song that came in my head for Sonic Adventures and Sonic, Sonic Adventures. So I'm like, damn it. But between one and three, one and three, and then Sonic Sonic Adventures one and two have some good ass music that you can just sit sit back and be like, yeah, I can play this. All right, and just listen to it. So let's see. That was two cheaters in a row. Maggie, bring us home. Uh, <laughs> She's about to say Minecraft. Oh, no. first of all, does that count Minecraft as a yeah? Game. I was like, that doesn't count as a series. Um, uh, they're getting there though. Um, <laughs> they they have multiple games now. I don't see. Ooh, the, no, see the thing is, I keep my because lately I've been listening to music from Nintendo again because of like homework and stuff that's those are like the only things that come to mind because that's something i listen to all the time like i go out of my way to to listen to it and not only to like relax me but i actually enjoy it um so it like my brain just keeps going back to animal crossing because i've been playing it since it was on the ds and I listen to playlists that have all the music from the DS, the Wii, the 3DS, and the Switch. So I listen to like a 10-hour playlist (laughs) of 
every hour because with animal crossing the music changes every single hour right so all of that combined across four games i've never played the gamecube one but i've played all the other ones that have been out um even 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 the one one. gamecube was fun even the one that you can play the pocket camp the one that you can play on your phone for free all of the music across all of it i thoroughly enjoy and i love that the game literally every hour the music's different and yeah you play the next day and it's the same at that hour but like you hear the clock go and it's 12 now and all of a sudden it's a new song and the music goes with whatever time of day it is if you're playing at 5 a.m it's slow it's like a lullaby it's like almost melancholic if it's 12 o'clock in the afternoon it's upbeat it's like trying to get you up and moving if it's 11 p.m again it's slower trying to get you to like wind down for the day and i think that's something i can really appreciate across all of the games and even with the wii one there's like a whole town you can go into and the music changes based on what store you're in what character you're talking to and things like that so i would have to say animal well that was at least a thought out answer (laughs) Listen, I've been in school a long time. I've gotten really good about thinking on the fly. <laughs> hey, there you go. All right. I don't think we got to do games con- coming soon this week because there's not really any updates from the last yeah. couple of weeks. <clears throat> yeah. Also, if I'm just being honest, I've been doing the pee-pee dance in my chair for like 20 minutes. <laughs> ah. <laughs> <laughs> So I'm ready to wrap this up. How's everybody yeah. else feeling? Yeah. yeah, this is why I, got, I shouldn't I'm drink a hard seltzer at the beginning. That's why I drink I, I should, it. Like yeah. halfway yeah. through, I that's why like halfway through I should crack it and then I'll be okay. Uh, so I think that's it. If anyone else has got anything else going on this week, anyone else? Man, I'll, I'll get better at those sentences. At <laughs> yeah, mm. uh, I might buy that humble bundle. I put in the, the, the group chat. I'll, it's time for some spooky games. Spoopy for, for anyone listening, it's a humble Spookish. bundle called Scary Games to Play in the Dark. And it is a oh, whole no, bunch yeah, of yeah, different yeah. spooky scary games, like the Mortuary Assistant, which everyone was obsessed with for a long time. Um, Prop Night, mm-hmm. things like that. So <clears throat> we are all thinking about getting it. And by we all, I mean probably them three, because I'm scared. <laughs> I think stop being all. I think stop by, being stop being uh, a weakling. I think by we all, uh, you mean Floyd. <laughs> that's, that's true. Yeah, that's just true. Me, mostly. Yeah. Floyd is definitely the type of person that I, would. Play I looked in the at dark. it and I was like, I'm not gonna play these. So <laughs> I might. I'm here for it. I'm just here for the chaos. <laughs> look, you. Yeah. Look, you might not play these games. I'm not playing Borderlands Three no more though. Hey, there's a <laughs> Oh, you're right. You know what? My whole thing was I was going to bring that up when we were talking about... Okay, imagine that it's like 20 minutes ago, and I was smart, and I remembered to do this. <laughs> so, um, so the best video game music for, for a game, I mean, Borderlands 3 sucks. Um, and that was going to oh. be how I got it in this week. So, uh, well, I was gonna, add, I was gonna say, I was like, what? No one's gonna bring up Borderlands Three. <laughs> oh no, I'm, no, I was realizing, I was like, oh shit. Well, we get- he slightly referenced it, and I was like, that counts in my brain. So, <laughs> I was like, damn, we're getting closer to the end of this. We didn't say yeah. nothing about Borderlands Three. Let me, yeah, let no. me bring something up about <clears> Borderlands. We almost quick. got out of it. Damn. I'll just have to. They almost made it. I'll just have to like get out their weekly oh, slander. Man, I'll tell you what. It would have just ended up, I would have called the episode that, I would have put it in the description, I would have recorded myself saying it, and just like, spliced yeah, it in somewhere. Yeah, just randomly. I would have made up for it by putting it everywhere. <laughs> just like putting I it behind, <laughs> put it behind as we talk, boy, land sucks, boy, yeah. it sucks. Do you hear that in yeah. the distance? <laughs> it's the sound of Borderlands 3 sucking. <laughs> Is that you coming across the Himalayas? <laughs> Yeah, I really, I really do. Okay, I, bye. I, I, <laughs> okay, okay, okay. All right, we love you all. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye bye. Bye.